What's good, YouTube? It's your man, BG Tech Life, and today I'm bringing y'all more OnePlus coverage, guys. Yes, more OnePlus 7 Pro coverage. I'm low-key starting to fall in love with this device, guys. It was a couple things I had to do to iron it out, and you're looking at the biggest thing right now. Let's talk about what's on it and what I've been doing with it since I got it. Okay, so I put a speed in. I believe this is a tough armor case for speed in. Nice little kickstand on here, guys. Adds a little bulk. I like that. It's giving me something to grip, guys. I'm not giving, getting any of them false edge touches that's making the phone act weird. None of that. That was probably my biggest gripe about the phone off the break. So I threw me a nice case on the device, and now I'm not having that problem at all. And I'm really getting to enjoy this snappy device from OnePlus, guys. Snappy old school device. This is an uncle now. You know, this is not the young gunner. This is the uncle. This is the OnePlus 7 Pro. And these times in tech, I'm taking it back. I'm taking it. We all, we going back in time, guys, and revisiting some of this stuff because this is some stuff that y'all could pick up. Okay, guys, so I did do some things to this device. So let's just go ahead and get into what I did to the device, guys. So, okay, see my um, live screen, typical OnePlus stuff. Added me a nice little wallpaper. If you know me, you know my... uh wall my home my home my lock screens my wallpapers they're gonna be cars guys I'm, I'm in the cars i like cars i'm a car guy so we're gonna go ahead and um got the mg bins on here we're gonna go ahead and unlock this thing guys you're gonna see my, my home screen setup so the first thing i did with this device is i took it to nova guys i took it to nova launch it um i like messing with older devices guys so i don't you know i don't have this device to be like oh i need to see exactly what one plus ui does i saw that in the first couple days but i want to do something different i want one plus you can customize your device pretty good but with nova launch it's so many other things that you can do on this device and i'm on the beta they have a new uh beta nova launch out this is beta uh seven you can download it off the nova launch website if you want to try it out and there's a couple different things that you can do with nova launcher now they had they've upgraded some things and we've lost some things but um yeah as you can see i got my apps on my home screen going horizontally and vertically ac across the edges so you can still see my wallpaper i don't like the car to be completely covered up by the apps and i feel like i with this setup i could fit me about uh, a nice amount of apps on the home screen and i got the uh google now uh clock widget going on so um first of all with the nova launch i can add the companion so i can swipe to my left and i can get like my google now type stuff and all, a little articles guys and you see how it is you see how quick that thing is this uh 90 hertz and then you then if you go to developer options and mess with the uh, animations guys this is a super snappy phone uh, so i'm really i'm I, I must say it's super snappy it's i thought it was gonna be fast but it's faster than i expected and i'm i like when things are better than i expected the camera's actually better than i expected that's gonna be in another video though but yeah so like i said i got nova launcher on here and basically you swipe to the left one swipe is some email junk and swipe again I, I gotta keep a calendar guys because i gotta know what the day and the date and the time all that type of stuff so pretty much very simple very snappy guys um i'm not really gonna go over the apps that i have on this thing because they are typical apps guys i'm using this device for social media and i'm using it for gaming as you seen in the last video guys the gaming video um, you can you see what I play the uh, CSL racing I play uh, Leo's fortune and one thing I do play that I didn't uh, play on the game and um, the gamer type review gaming video I did on this phone I didn't play Call of Duty but I um, mean yeah, we swipe up and I like this setup right here guys I like when I can use my wallpaper still as my background for my apps and add a little you know let it be a little transparent so you can see the wallpaper shine through but not completely through as you can see i got the um wallpaper where's though is the white parts is dark enough is it's not fully transparent so you can still see 
uh, the names of the apps and things of that nature, guys. So, very, very dope stuff here, guys. Um, as you can see, right now, I got a setup for Gcam. I have the Gcam app on the device. I have to test, um, I'm, you know, I have to test Gcam against the regular camera and see what takes better pictures or the regular camera app and see what's, what helps me out, what, what utilizes the hardware better, what software utilizes the hardware better. So this is another thing from Android 7, guys. Um, as you can see, I got my, my search bar down here, my Google search bar, but I can also get to the Play Store and I can, you can like kind of add as a couple uh, apps you can add to this thing. I can get to the Play Store and I can do a voice search immediately. So I click the Play Store. I'm there immediately, guys. I think that's really dope. Um, right here, I click on this Google and it's gonna take me to Google search, guys. So that's pretty, that's very, very dope, guys. Um, I like how you can add some things down here. Make some, I like to be able to make my home screen as functional as possible as many apps as possible without looking cluttered and as many little gestures and secrets as possible without you know just without making it too crazy but yeah so and there's a lot of things you can do because you just hold down the screen we can go to nova we can go to the settings and there's so many things you could do with nova launcher as far as the you can uh customize your home screen the app drawer which i showed y'all you could customize the different folders, how they look. I don't really put a lot of apps in folders. That's not my thing. You can uh, you can configure the search bar, guys. Kind of what I did, as you can see. Um, you can do some different things with the search bar. I don't want to mess up anything right now. And you can get the uh, Sesame app, which helps you with more plugins from Google for your Nova launcher, guys. Very dope stuff here. Um, of course, you got night mode. You got different gestures. It's so many gestures. You can set your phone up like you can make your own gestures, guys, and 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 make apps react different ways to um <clears throat> to two different movements. Like I can have the same app and it'll open that app up if I press on it, but if I swipe up, it might open my Instagram. Just things like that, guys. As you can see, you got a lot of gestures. Swipe up, double tap, double tap, swipe up. You know, a combination. Uh, two fingers swipe up it's just a lot of things that you can do to customize your device with Nova launcher guys I haven't really got fully into it but I'm just this is just my basic setup here guys and because when I when I set up a phone like this I put a couple I put a little time into it to set it up now I'm about to really utilize it but I must say that this thing like I said in the, the performance video is performing but um yeah this is how i got a setup guys i got the nova launcher going on and basically keeping it kind of google-ish but at the same time um you know the snappiness of the eight the a55 is just doing this thing guys with this nova launcher and i wanted to develop my options guys and uh scale down the animation so the animations look a little quicker things of that nature um, and it's, it's running pretty good, guys. I must say, it's running, it's performing top tier. Uh, there's no difference between this and my S21. And this is a what? A 2019 phone, but no difference between this and my S21. I have to get into the cameras, guys, but this is basically what's on the device. We got Nova Launcher. We're keeping it real Google-ish. And it's, it's just, as you can see, nice 90 hertz display, working really well, quick animations. And I mean, we just in there like swimwear, guys. So that's what's going on with my OnePlus 7 Pro right now. I'm still using it. As you can see, I got a SIM card in it from Google Fi. Um, and we this this is no cap here, guys. Um, I said I was gonna use the OnePlus 7 Pro in 2021, and we doing it, and that's how it's going. And maybe you'll get some ideas on customizing your device. So you like the wallpapers. Oh yeah, let me shout out Zedge, because that's where I get my wallpapers from, guys. Zedge. All these other apps here, it's nothing that you should know here. I don't have anything extravagant. I really don't do content creation with this device, guys. So, um, yeah, it's your man, BG Tech Life. Go ahead, follow me on Instagram. Go ahead, follow me on Twitter, BG underscore Tech Life. I will be coming to TikTok soon, man. Um, it's your man, BG. Thanks for watching. I'm out. Peace.